Gentlemen, what's happening? Well, you've probably noticed that a lot of men's hairstyles that you're seeing these days have a lot of lift, a lot of volume. They're definitely not flat. Everybody from Ryan Seacrest to Adam Levine are rocking some type of side parted pompadour. So today I'm going to teach you how to give your hair a little lift by adding incredible volume. All right, so to give your hair a little lift and to actually maintain that hold and that volume throughout the day, you're going to need a few items. You are going to need a hairbrush, you're going to need a hair dryer, and then I'm actually going to be using two different hair styling products. I'm using Pete and Pedro, the putty and the paste, but if you're looking for something comparable, you need some type of styling paste and some type of fibery, something that's going to give it some substantial hold. All right, so the first thing I do after I towel dry my hair is actually comb it generally into place. I'm going to give myself a little part right there. Then I'm actually going to hit it with a hair dryer and blow it into place. Notice that I'm actually blowing it against the grain. You're starting the lifting process by actually blowing it up. Not just over, but up. What you're left with is some type of this action. Next, what you're going to do is actually put in the paste. You're going to get a small amount. Rub it in your hands and then work it through your hair in the general direction, making sure to keep it in two separate sections. The part that's going down and the part that's coming up. All right, and then just work it into your hair. Now, one thing to consider, when you apply the styling paste, you can't just go on top. You got to get all the way down to the root. All right, in order for this hairstyle to hold and to stay all day long, you need to actually get that hair product all over your hair. A lot of times people say, hey, when I leave the house, my, house, or my hair looks great. I go out in about an hour, my hair is flat and looks like hell. Well, one of the reasons that you're probably experiencing that is because you're A, not using a product that holds strong enough and B not getting it all over that hair shaft. So once you're done applying that first product, the paste, then it's time to hit it with the hair dryer again. And so after you've hit it with the hair dryer a second time, then you're actually going to come in with your brush and brush it into place, all right? All right, and so as you can see, it kind of looks a little bit like a helmet right now. Well, that's when you come in and take the second product. Any type of fiber, putty, what you're going to do is take a little bit, and this is really to add separation and to give it that finishing touch as far as hold is concerned. So you take just a little bit, not a whole lot, and then start working it with your fingertips into your hair and you're going to twist little twists. What that's going to do is actually separate the hairs a little bit, make it a little bit more PC, but uh, right there. And I'd say that's about it. Your hair, after that second application of the harder, more substantial hold product, it's actually going to lock it into place. So now you are rocking the old school pompadour, baby, all day long. It's pretty simple. And am I the only one who makes dumb, stupid faces when they do their hair? I can't even stop. I, I don't even realize I'm doing it. All of a sudden, I'll watch a video. I'm like, why am I doing blue steel? 